TV sound system, you know what it is. Select a high live and direct. Remember to press that subscribe button. We get the exclusives there, even though the videos are few and far apart, but when they come, man, do they not come bigger than this man sitting next to me right about now. I bet you everybody's watching and thinking, rah, some questions I got asked. But he is live and direct in Luton, who can bust the dance? Platinum Cartel, Chalice Naya in the building. Fam, what's going down? Don't know, there. Man, it's been a crazy, since the last time we kind of spoke, you went through a lot, man. There was a big, you know, the UK rumble. Didn't really get a chance to get an interview off you to even like get your thoughts on that whole situation. I think time has passed. Don't know whether you want to kind of like dwell on that because rumble is now coming back around again. <laughs> um, let's talk about, I mean, I mean, winning rumble. I mean, how was that for you at that moment in time? I know there was a lot of preparation, but going in there and actually winning, um, how was it for you? To be honest, it was just a relief. <laughs> Cartel for me is, is, is always been a bad son. It's just that, you know, to be honest, you've got fractions that rate Cartel, fractions that don't. Mm -hmm. And for me to go rumble and win it was more of a relief more than anything else. Uh -huh. And then from there, you went over there to go and represent in Canada. Mm -hmm. um, that was a kind of, it was a kind of a mad dance because Unfortunately, you came out first round. anti -clan. But you didn't play bad. Like, nobody says, yeah, Platinum Cartel was whack. They, should, they deserve to go out first round. It was just like, so, all the sounds were performing really good. And unfortunately, I, I, don't know, I don't know, what made you think, like, the reason why you came out first? To be honest, uh, guy in Rumble, I mean, guy in World Class. Mm -hmm. uh, how can I put it? We deserve to come out that round because mm -hmm. if you have people there that there's a home sound there and and usually they'll go with the home sound mm. and for us we never played our style in okay. terms of what the people them know us for mm. first round yeah played our style mm -hmm. second round I should I really go for the juggler but I thought I would just you know I kind of if I'm gonna be honest I didn't play I didn't uh, we didn't strategize in the way that I would have usually strategized to play a mm -hmm. dance. I think, to be honest, you know, sometimes when you hear people talking about, ah, oh, your that style isn't gonna work. That style, I didn't, I didn't go there with the confidence of saying that this is what bring cartel to to rumble. Yeah. So this is what to uh, to work clash. So this is what you're gonna get. Mm -hmm. So I tried to change it, and it never okay. worked. Okay. So we and fast forward happened. now, and um, you want to clash. Like early January, innit? Yeah, with which was and, and White Magic. Uh huh. Um, again, another win underneath your belt after going to UK Rumble and then um, not unfortunately not winning that uh, World Clash, but then coming back to the UK. But this thing are UK, and, right? And, no, no, no. And UK for a place, you know, no matter what anybody wants, you know, and if someone would challenge cartel in the UK, I got to have a hard time, uh -huh. you know. But that kind yeah. of that kind of brings me to the next question on why, which everybody wants to know. Why are you not defending the UK Rumble this year after doing so well, proving to the people then that Platinum Cartel ain't no pushover, really represented on the stage, dominated the whole situation. Um, why are you not there to represent this year? Firstly, let me apologise to the fans that really wanted to see us there. Uh, I spoke with uh, the World Clash promotion team early I mean, late last year. Mm -hmm. I remember, if you remember, before Rumble, I'd even said I was going to retire. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was retiring anyway. Mm -hmm. And we was hoping that the new team would have been ready to go forward. But there's a lot of personal stuff going on for, in terms of, I would, I was sure the most of the responsibility in terms of a lot of personal stuff going on for me, mm -hmm. which means that at the end of the day, I could not fully get the new team prepared in time for Rumble. Uh -huh. There's a lot of, there's a lot of stuff going on. Valerie know the 100, uh -huh. Chin know the 100. It's not that we just didn't want to represent. It's just that World Clash is one of them things. If, if we're going for the second bite of the cherry, you have to be planning ahead, not just for planning now. Uh -huh. Personally, if I believe that if we went on work Rumble uh -huh. now, we would have won it. Uh -huh. But if I'm going to be honest, we wouldn't be prepared to be going to Canada. To Canada again. Okay, so, I hear that. truth be told, 
I think they've got some good sounds on it mm -hmm. that can go forward think, and do, do, do the do damage. You, do you think it's going to affect your credibility and your brand? Probably will. By, by not Probably not. will. But how, would you, how would you rectify that? Do you know what? We do what we do. Mm -hmm. Probably will uh, uh, damage the credibility and the brand. And as I said, I would take responsibility for that. Most of the world don't like me anyway, so I don't know. It's, 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 just a, it's just one of those things. If they want to take it up on me, mm. I'm here. My back's okay, broad cool. for that. What it is, is the brand in itself speaks for itself. People know what the brand can do. Mm -hmm. If they need to shoot at anybody, they can shoot at me. Mm -hmm. and, and that's fine. If people are entitled to their opinions, entitled to the way they feel, and just the reality. But let's be honest, Carter... The only reason why Carter honored the clash in January is because it was booked prior. Mm -hmm. But if you notice, Carter hasn't taken any of a clash coming up, and there has been clash. Mm -hmm. There has been clash date in Australia, clash day in in Trinidad, and clash day in in, in Miami, mm -hmm. and we haven't taken any okay. because at the end of the day, out of respect for uh, the Rumble brand and that. We couldn't do that, mm -hmm. if you understand. So that's the reality. Okay, cool. TV Sound System, Chalice Nice up inside the building. All right, then. Thoughts of the, the, the current UK Rumble lineup. Uh, I'm sure you know who's, who's, who's in it. Decent lineup, man. Big lineup. I think, to be honest, if that's what we got to offer, that's what we got to offer. I think mm -hmm. there's, there'll be a lot of surprises uh, in terms of the sounds them there. I think every sound has a chance. Mm -hmm. And the reason why every sound has a chance, every sound on the bill has something unique about them. Yeah. If it's not the mic man, it's the music selection. If it's not the music selection, it's the variation with artists. Mm -hmm. If it's not that, Fan base there's, alone, you understand? So that. what what you're gonna see there at Rumble is that it's gonna be one of those. It may look like the lineup. It may not be the lineup what most people wanted to see, but it's the lineup that you've got. So you work with it and you give them the support the same way. And as far as I'm concerned, I believe a champion will come out of that. Now, considering that you're not in it now, mm -hmm. imagine you was in it. Now, obviously you're going to win, which is a sound. So what we do. <laughs> but obviously when you're doing your preparation, you're going to say to yourself, boy, if I watch out for that sound there. Now, you can, you don't have to sit on the fence because you're not even in the dance. So who would be the sound that you'd be saying, you know what? As defending champions, and unfortunately not in it, who's the sound that you kind of think you would have been going to to tune? Because obviously you would have wanted to win. So I'm not asking you for a winner. I'm asking you who do you think you would have been going tune for tune with, is as the defending champion. Out of the lineup, mm -hmm. Mike Man Wise, I think more than is the strongest. Uh huh. Our King Jamin, if him can, if them allow him for. If do I do, I think people's in problem. Mm. Overall rise, Empire definitely in the mix, you understand? Mm. Uh, but personally, can't call it you know, in terms of who I would have gone tune for tune with. Because look how it worked out last, last year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Everybody, crazy. it might tell that shit went right at the end, mm -hmm. you understand? So, so you can't, there's no one in particular? It's, to be honest, like I said, every one of them on the bill have something unique about them and it's, it's ooh, gravity. Remember when Cartel went there, you know, it's, it's not about you focus on, on, on a sound and try to go through, you know, it's about you entertaining the crowd. Mm -hmm. And I think all of them can do that. Man. You know, I definitely want my London team then for the well, uh -huh. but I think the odds are stacked heavily against them. The Birmingham on them and, and, and it, the Midlands on them, uh, up north on them, they're hungry, man. They're hungry. Mm -hmm. And then I don't see them wanting to be to see a repeat of mm -hmm. what happened at the. <laughs> <laughs> at your team still. So, future plans for. I'm going to wrap it up. Future plans for Platinum Cartel. Obviously, not, not defending the, the UK Rumble. So, what, is the, what are the steps? What are we looking out for? What are we seeing? Are you retired? Are you not retired? Yeah, man, I'm, I'm fully retired. Uh, if it's a if it's a all it starts, I'm uh -huh. the man. Okay. But I'm fully retired and K Specials the the, the new recruit on the sound right mm -hmm. now. And we're still looking to kinda like strengthen the squad. Mm -hmm. But yeah man, I'm fully retired and, and I'm fully enjoying it now. Like at the end of the day yes, pressure. I bring the sound where it needed to go and it's gonna take a whole it for bring me up man and at the end of the day what can I say? <laughs>
<laughs> Who knows what the future holds? But all I can say is, fans and fan base, apologies, and you get me. It was we couldn't do nothing more than what we are doing right now, mm -hmm. and then that's why we're not there. It's not a disrespecting. It's just one of those things. Big up Strokey, big up Colin K, Special Blade, Cam Cartel, the whole works. Big up Juxi, you don't know. Arthur, what can we say? say? Chalice. I you know you gotta go and get ready, you know, because I'm not playing. I know, but I know you gotta go and support your team. So you know, who can bust the dance? I'm sure you still want Platinum Cartel to be one of the sounds to bust the dance. So yeah, which we are not busting. <laughs> yeah. yeah, people, make sure you subscribe. TV Sound System Select High Platinum Cartel. You know what it is, man. Please subscribe. Keep it locked right here. We're out. One piece. I remember, sir, the rest of you trying to do video shoot. You understand? <laughs> Boom. Peace out.